Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write java program to reverse a string so guys basically as you can see in this example if the string is equal to a b c we are supposed to get another string that is the reverse string and the content of this string will be c b a which is the reverse order of this original string that is a b c so guys let us write a java program to do so so let me just move to the eclipse id over here and first of all we will define the string that is string over here and i'll say s str it is equal to abc in this case so inside this quotes we are going to write abc as the string over here now guys we are going to have another string that is the reverse string in this case in which we are going to have the reverse order of this string that is abc so initially the reverse string is blank so what we will do is the logic behind this program is very simple we have to go through the for loop and we have to extract each character over here and that character needs to be appended in the front of this reverse string so what we will do is we will have another character that is ch over here and we will store each character inside this ch variable so we have a for loop over here and this for loop it will go from int i it is equal to 0 to i less than whatever the string is up to the length of the string so we have the length method over here which will return us the length of the string that is entered by the user or if it is defined inside our program itself so after this inside this for loop we will have i plus plus so what we will do is we will extract the first character that is a by using this variable that is i and store it inside this ch so over here ch it will be equal to we will use the original string that is str followed by dot and then we have a method called character at so guys this char at will be used in order to get one character from this original string and which will be that character we will be using this i variable that is starting position it will be 0 so in this case the i value is 0 and since i value is 0 the character that will be returned is the first character that is a since it is a zeroth based index the character at the second index that is i is equal to 1 will be b in that case now guys since we have found this character what we have to do is we have to append this character character in front of this reverse string so over here after the statement we will have reverse string over here again and then reverse string it will be equal to ch plus reverse string once again so whatever the reverse string is we will be appending in front of that the character that we have extracted just now and then we will store the entire result back again to the reverse string and after this for loop we will be printing this reverse string in order to find the reverse of the original string over here so we will have the print statement and we'll say reversed string is and then we have colon and then we have reverse string over here as the variable name so guys let me just save this file and try running this code now so as you can see reverse string is c b a so basically the original string was a b c and we have just reversed it and the content of the reverse string is c b a let me just put another string over here let's say we have x y z over here and then let me just save this file and try running this code now so as you can see z y x that is the reversed string let me just put programming for beginners string over here that is the name of this youtube channel which you should definitely subscribe let me just run this code once again as you can see programming for beginners is being printed in the reverse order over here so guys in this way you can easily write a java program that will help us in order to reverse a particular string so guys that's it in this video please make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is java program for fibonacci series so stay tuned